fetching things for Frank. How low can I go? Wait, Frank got a puppy? For real? Ah, oh, man. Rachel the therapist would have a field day with this. Shit. The mill burned down. Jeez. That's an expensive dog. People leave their info when they damage someone's car? Well, the fire is spreading in an unusual way, sort of surrounding the northern part of Arcadia Bay, but not advancing towards. Unusual indeed. What causes the fire to behave that way? I don't honestly know. Right now, we're doing everything we can just to keep it contained. Gary. Well, there you have it. Straight from the fire chief's mouth. Thanks for filling us in, Jack. You're welcome. Been a pleasure. Hey there. <laughs> it's okay, little guy. Aw, oh, shit! Pompadou, get up here! Pompadou? You little killer. what I think it is. Ugh, shit. I'm in the red. Time to find out what Frank wants to discuss. Is this it? Have a seat. Pompadou, huh? That's one badass name for a dog. It's French. <laughs> okay, but he's not a poodle, Frank. No, he's not. But I'm gonna treat him like one. Okay, so who was that woman? What woman? The one I saw coming out of your RV. Oh yeah, I meant to introduce you. Her name is Mind Your Own Fucking Business. Rachel would want to know more. I bet I can convince Frank it's harmless to tell me. Dude, I'm just curious. What's the big deal? Idiot. I make money by being discreet. Frank, you know I hate everyone. Who do you think I'm gonna tell? Come on, Price. I gotta protect my clients. Happy customers are the foundation of a good business. People feel flattered when you give them inside info. If you want happy customers, tell them all your secrets. Sure, I guess. So why are you so hung up on this chick? I'm... I'm not. Just hanging with a friend here. A friend I don't know much about. Tell me, Frank. Seeing any girls lately? I don't know. Frank. Talk, and I'll get my mom to make you something special. Like what? Uh... How about that firehouse chili of hers? You... You got it. The woman you saw. Her name's Sarah. Showed up a few weeks ago. Causing all kinds of trouble for all sorts of people. Like who? It's a little out of your league, okay? But what kind of trouble, exactly? Forget about it, Chloe. I shouldn't have opened my mouth. Thanks... 
for <laughs> telling me. Whatever. You hear the mill burn down? <sighs> Shit. Really? Crazy. My friend Damon runs the place. He lost a lot of money last night. Money from what? Well, he's always had a few things going on. I help him out with some of them. Don't drown me in the details, Frank. Lately, he's been doing some stuff that I don't like. But I don't seem to have much leverage with him like I once had. Anyway, you and I have shit to discuss. Is this about the buck 75? What? The money that I owe you? Oh, yeah. Yeah, no, I, I don't give a shit about that. Wait, do you have it? Give me like another week. I don't have enough right now. I wonder if I'll ever get tired of your crap. You're lucky you're the least of my problems. Open my notebook. Last page. Should be some entries for a kid named Drew. You know him? <laughs> Drew North? Y yeah, he's... Holy shit. That's a lot of money. Drew runs Oxy for Damon. Apparently football players eat it like candy. That's smart, I guess. It pays well? Go Bigfoots. Problem is, Drew owes a grant, and he's not answering my calls. You know what's going on with them? Uh, he's an unreliable douchebag. No, this is the first time he's done this. The kid's actually smart. Anyway, here's the job. I'm taking you to Blackwell. Go to Drew's room, find the money, and I'll meet you to pick it up. Can you handle that? Yeah, of course, but what's in it for me? Idiot, you still owe me. So, if I do this, then we're good? That, and I'll do even better. I'll give you a 10% cut of the money. Okay. Yeah, sure. I'll do it. What's the matter? It might be a little tough. I, I'm not supposed to be at Blackball. I got expelled this morning. Congratulations. It's still easier for you to go on campus than for me. If you can't even do this price... A hundred dollars closer to leaving Arcadia Bay. With a bit of cash and the truck fixed, Rachel and I could really do it. We could leave for good. I'll do it. Good deal. this soon. Well, here goes nothing. the dorms. Locked. <laughs> Figures. Looks like my options are become a master lock picker or swipe someone's keys.
Hey, Steph. Whoa. Hey, Chloe. Your shirt looks like the tea leaves they used to tell people's fortunes. How's my future looking? Bright and sunny. Surprised to see me on parole? I told you Wells was out to get you. That text was a rare courtesy, by the way. I don't normally get involved in other people's dumb decisions. Thanks for trying, but skipping yesterday was totally worth it. Skipping with Rachel Amber does have an appeal. Well, yeah. So what are you doing here? I figured I'd see the Tempest. For real? You? Yeah, I know. It's not really my thing. Uh, <laughs> kinda hoping it's a shit show. What the hell? I'm the stage manager. Oh, I think I knew that. My bad. You better mean it. Honestly, the show's really good. It's worth seeing. I'm sure it is. Obviously, Rachel's fantastic, but everyone else is pretty impressive, too. You get to see a totally different side of everyone, especially the guys. Okay. I'm intrigued. Go on. Like, Hayden's so annoying, but when he puts on that crown, he's actually very princely. And Nathan is Caliban? <laughs> There's so much depth there. Right. Depth. Yeah, well, good luck with all of that. <laughs> Maybe I'll see you later. Oh, hey. I wanted to ask you something. Shoot. I've been planning to make a move on Rachel, but not if you two were together. Make a move? So, are you? Uh... I mean, that's Rachel's business. Or maybe yours and Rachel's business. But if you feel comfortable telling me... I'm... Uh, I, I don't know. It's... It's... Confusing. <laughs> yeah, I, I can imagine. You ever want to talk to me, Chloe? You know you can, right? I'll see you later, Steph. Have fun storming the castle. Hey, Samuel. Keeping busy? Always, Chloe Price. I didn't think you'd be returning to these hallowed halls so soon. <laughs> Neither did I. I have the feeling it wasn't uh, the books or bricks of Blackwell that led you back. <laughs> what? You're here for someone. A special someone, yes? I'm, uh... <laughs> Uh, looking for Drew North. Most look at Drew North and see only the athlete, but he is more than that. He is? A great heart he has, with much love and no room for fear. <sighs> I've always thought he was kind of a bully. He may be that, too. No one is just one thing. What do you think of uh, Rachel Amber? Rachel Amber is a dragon made of diamonds. That's, uh, deep. <laughs> do you just make this shit up on the fly, or do you, like, write it down beforehand? Are you angry all the time because you like the way it feels, or is it merely a desperate defense against experiencing true intimacy with others. So, uh, what about Elliot Hampton? Have you seen him recently? I only see what Elliot wants me to see. 
Okay. Usually I can see both what people want me to see and what they want to keep hidden. And uh, what, what do I want to keep hidden? That you are lonely and afraid. That's not true at all, man. It's okay not to be okay, Chloe Price. I've got to go, man. Uh, <laughs> it's been real. I often wonder what real is. Farewell, Chloe Price. Bingo. If only those keys were unsupervised. What's Samuel working on? Uh, the sprinklers? How can I get Samuel away from his keys? Uh. If Samuel's working on the sprinklers, some damage here might get his attention. But Evan is right there. What are you doing here? Aren't you supposed to be at home thinking over your endless list of questionable decisions? Dude, why do you care about my questionable decisions? It offends me when intelligence is wasted. <laughs> Did Evan just call me intelligent? Damn straight. Wow. Evan looks really ridiculous. Hey, uh... Evan, as intelligent as you look right now, you can still see that bird from where I'm standing. I appreciate your concern, but I want to get this shot exactly right. And I've learned something about myself recently. I've learned that if I'm passionate about something, it's probably the right thing to care about. For example, I've been trying to get the students and administration interested in forest fire prevention. That is kind of an odd topic to focus on. People are so eager to pass on responsibility to anyone else so that they can live comfortable, unworried, and ultimately meaningless lives. You see what happened? <laughs> Looks like you were right. <laughs> Go, Evan. You're a hero of the people. I know you feel like I do. About different things, I'm sure. But you only give a shit about what you give a shit about. I like that. A anyway, you're not supposed to be here. You should leave. Hey! Shit! I wanted you to go the other way. Like, as far as possible, the other way. Time for a fresh start. Here we go.
Gotcha. Oh, perfect. You're welcome. Awesome. Now I just have to wait for Samuel to turn on the... <laughs> that works. Sorry, Samuel. All right, time to find Drew's room. No time like the present. Skip, how's it going? Not that it isn't great to see you and all, but what are you doing here? Didn't you just get expelled? Relax. I'm just uh, visiting a friend. I, I can't... I, I really can't just let you go in. I'm going inside, dude. <laughs> You're just gonna have to let this slide. I don't think I can. In fact, I think I have to ask you to state your official business or else vacate Blackwell property. I hate to do this to Skip, but I've got to get inside. Maybe if I make him really uncomfortable, he'll feel guilty and let me pass. What's my official business? Going to the bathroom. Is that what you wanted to hear? Is that interesting to you? What? No. No, it's my job to ask, Chloe. Your job is creepy, then. Which makes you kind of a creeper. Oh, it's not like that. Do you know what Wells would do to me if I didn't, you know, patrol? Is Wells pressuring you to write more students up? I'm not even a student, but sure. Don't let that stop you. I thought we were friends. Where is this coming from? I just really need to get by, okay? Let me go. <sighs> Chloe, I just have this feeling like you're up to... Wait. You talked me into letting you into the bathroom this morning, and then you tagged the entire friggin' place! What? No, I... I uh... Eh, <laughs> uh, fuck it. I totally did that. Wells raked me over the coals for that! Ugh, time to go. Or what? What are you gonna do, Skip? Cause unless you're prepared to drag me off this campus, I'm going inside. Chloe, enough! This is my job. Just go. You have never respected me. You and all your smug little classmates. I am so tired of being shit on by high schoolers. You know what? I'm done. I'm done with this stupid rent-a-cop job. Just, just do whatever the fuck you want, Chloe. Whoa, Skip. Matthew. I've gotten reports of an unknown vehicle in the parking lot. Uh, oh, 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 oh that, that's funny. Because I've, got, I've gotten reports about how your head is, is really far up your ass. What, what did you just say? 
Damn. Skip really lost it there. All right. Time to find Drew's room. Which one is Drew's room? Guess I'll never see my name on one of these. I wouldn't have made it to senior year anyway. Good. <laughs> Drew's not here. Okay. <laughs> if I were Drew, where would I hide my money? I don't like the look of this dude. They look so happy. <laughs> Looks like Mikey's been staying here with Drew. <laughs> Mikey's figures. <laughs> Playing that game yesterday was actually fun. Is the money in there? All right. Guess I have... Holy shit, Drew. A college scholarship? No wonder you're so into football. Hmm. I wonder exactly how important 516 is to Drew. Look at that. More numbers. I didn't realize Drew was this good at sports. Frank wasn't lying. Looks like so many folks are shit out of luck around here. At least Drew has some prospects. Plenty of possible combinations here. Damn it. Wrong numbers. I wonder exactly how important 516 is to Drew. Holy shit, Drew. A college scholarship? 
No wonder you're so into football. Damn it. Wrong numbers. Look at that. More numbers. Damn it. Wrong numbers. <sighs> Might actually need some help with this one. One, two, two, seven. Ugh, worth a shot. Yes! This is kind of fun. Ah. Oh. Did little Drew beat you up too? <sighs> Jackpot. I'm kind of good at this. Okay, got the money. Time to bust out of here. <laughs> hey, Elamon. Chloe? What are you doing here? I was <laughs> looking for your brother, but uh, he's not here, so... Why? Bro, we gotta go. Yesterday wasn't enough? You wanna go another round? Doesn't matter. Mikey, get your stuff, let's move. Drew, relax. Slow down. Shit. You're making me think you're nervous about something. Who the hell is that? No one. Stay in here and don't say anything, little brother. Whatever you do, don't open the door. You know what's going on? Damon, you shouldn't have come here. School's not the place for this. Really? Where is the place to collect my fucking money? Shit. I told you, I don't have it. Sales are down, man. Nobody wants to get high right now. But look, it's spring season. We just started two-a-days. Those are gonna kill us. I'll be able to sell all the oxy you've got. Drew, you owe me a grand. Where is it? I said I don't have it right now. I heard about your dad's job, by the way. Tough times. Yeah. Bet a grand would mean a lot to him right now. Where's my money, Drew? I don't know what you expect me to do. I can't just make money appear out of thin air. Oh, I want my fucking money! You don't have to hit me, man. I'm gonna... Where is it? Please! Just give me one week. You're just going to lie there? I thought football players were supposed to be tough. Sorry to have to do this, kid. No one steals from me. No one. Fuck. Fuck.
Let me go! No! Your brother said to stay inside. It'll be okay, Mikey. It'll be okay. Damn, you were one tough kid. Fuck you. Yeah? Well, what about this? Good luck running on that knee now. Bye-bye football. Well, I'm done. Get my money. Or maybe it'll be your little brother I talk to next. See you soon. Ugh. Ugh. Drew! It's, it's okay. I'm okay. Little brother. Thank you, Chloe. Thank you. I... I didn't do anything. You kept my brother safe. Drew? You need to get to the hospital. <sighs> Don't tell anyone about this, okay? Yeah. No. No way. What? Um... What are you going to do? <sighs> about Damon? I don't know. <sighs> One day at a time. I hear you. so messed up. At least I can talk to Rachel now. If I can find her back here. 